30 minutes ago, this was 100% liquid chocolate. Since then, it's metamorphosized into the sublime tortino al cioccolato. Just take a look at this baby here. This is the sort of thing you want to sell your grandmother for. When I open this up, a lava of molten chocolate is going to erupt from the core, hopefully straight into my mouth. Now, I've tasted this before, and I almost passed out. And I'm about to taste it again on camera. Let's see what happens. La la la! La la! Where do they get their energy from? That episode of The O.C. has me feeling a little cheated. When it rains here, all we get is a cold. To make up for it though, next week I'm going to be meeting the actress that plays Summer in The O.C. She's going to be joining me here in the studio for our live phone-in, which means that you can ask her pretty much any question you like. Now, you might have noticed back home recently in our supermarkets a wine called Montepulciano d'Abruzzo. Well, this is where it's made, and I'm standing next to Mr. Rossano Molisani, whose family has been producing it since 1742. That's a long time. Now, we're here to find out what the defining characteristics of the wine are and why it's gaining so much popularity back home. But what do we need before we start? A large frying pan, that's where the jowls are going to go, the guanciale as we call it, in there with a little bit of olive oil, fry up nicely, get it nice and crispy. Also a large saucepan, plenty of water in there, a bit of aqua just for the spaghetti. We've got ourselves a little bowl here, we're going to be breaking the eggs in there with a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, whisk them up nicely. And here we've got our pecorino romano, not parmigiano, remember that, very important, okay? So this is the final product, the famous stracciatella ice cream. But who actually came up with this idea? Well, it wasn't actually an ice cream maker, but rather a chocolate maker, who had just a little bit too much chocolate left after the Easter festivities and decided to throw it into some vanilla ice cream. What a good idea! But for my favourite bit... Mm. Ooh, something's happening. This is better than sex. No! no, wait, this is sex. Just very, very good sex and I have to go now. <laughs>